Today we're in Chesme, Turkey. We're gonna head up to the hills for a panoramic view over the peninsula, come into town for a walking tour, visit a Greek Orthodox church, and see a centuries old castle. We've got a lot to do, so let's get going. The name Chesme derives from the Turkish word for fountain. We learned that the name probably comes from the many Ottoman fountains throughout the city. Chesme was once the region's major port. The city also marked the end of the infamous Silk Road. Caravans came into town from Central Asia and the Middle East to unload their goods from camels for export to Europe on boats that sailed the Aegean and Mediterranean seas. We're on our walking tour in Chesme and we've been invited for refreshments. Now we have Turkish coffee here and these beautiful little things and also Turkish donuts. Now the name of these in Turkish is beyond my linguistic capabilities. But both of these have what's called mastika inside. Now mastika comes from the resin of trees and it's also used in chewing gum. So it's gonna be interesting to see how it tastes. First the coffee, it, uh, it looks a little bit like motor oil. Wow, that is an unusual taste. It's uh, it's not like the coffee I'm used to. It tastes like it has liqueur in it. And in fact, mystique is used in some liqueurs. It's used in Rocky, for example. We stepped inside the church of Agios Haralambos. The church is named for Saint Haralambos, a Christian bishop who worked to spread the Holy Gospel in this region for many years. He was arrested and brought to trial where he confessed his faith in Christ and martyred for that faith. Some sources say at the time of his martyrdom, the saint was 113 years old. Next, we stepped into Chesme Castle. With its six towers and moats on three sides, the castle is the focal point of the city. It's guarded by a statue of one of the naval commanders of the Battle of Chesme. The commander is depicted caressing his famous pet lion and facing the town square. The castle also has a small museum with ancient artifacts from various periods and from various wars throughout Turkish history in this region. I climbed up to the top of the castle for views over the city and the Aegean. It was absolutely stunning. I'm Ralph Grizzle and I'll see you in the next beautiful destination. <laughs>